class coupe is only available with one engine configuration right now, a 3.0-liter biturbo V6 that gives the A400 329 horsepower and 354 pound-feet of torque, sending it to either the rear axle or all four wheels via a 9-speed automatic transmission, 4MATIC is standard in Canada. Although Mercedes executives said an AMG 63 version isn't likely, a more powerful AMG 43 variant is definitely on its way. The E400's power figures don't look all that impressive on paper, considering four-cylinder sport compacts are easily surpassing those numbers, but in practice, the coupe hustles with respectable authority and never feels underpowered. The 9-speed transmission is smooth and responsive displaying no weirdness or glitchy behavior. The steering, although not terribly communicative, has a good weight to it and is dialed in and responsive. Even the stop-start system was smooth enough that I didn't need to turn it off, which I almost always do in other cars because it's too jarring. Two different suspension setups are available, a more traditional steel suspension with selective damping or an air suspension. As expected, the air suspension is much more advanced and helps the car feel more luxurious, allowing the coupe to glide over rough roads quietly and without spilling your tea, while also providing confidence inspiring stability at higher speeds. The steel suspension is a whisper noisier, but it doesn't really have any downsides. 